friends and welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, welcome. I'm so happy that you're here and if you've been here many, many, many times before, it's good to see you. Welcome back. This video today is about how to cozy up your room for this coming fall slash winter. I specifically didn't want to focus on just winter or just fall because I didn't want my room to explode in Christmas stuff. So basically I'm giving you guys a bunch of fun helpful tips and a couple DIYs for how to make your room cozier for the cold season. I had so much fun filming this. I hope that you guys enjoy it. Please let me know if you do by giving this video a thumbs up. Anyways, since I've been talking on and on and on forever now about this video I'm gonna go ahead and stop talking and get on into the video enjoy Hey everyone, here are a couple DIYs and some fun tips and tricks on how to get your room cozy and ready for the cold seasons. So really quickly, I just wanted to give you a quick little overview of what my room looks like before I went ahead and got it all cozied up. It has a lot of cool tones, it's very welcoming and light. Um, I'm going to change that up a little bit by adding a few knickknacks here and there and by creating my own DIY decorations. Up until that very moment, nothing else it seems. So for my first DIY, I'm going to be creating a kind of twinkling pixie dust mason jar effect. This DIY is really simple. All you need are a couple of basic mason jars, some sweater sleeves or socks, some scissors, and then you're going to take the sweater sleeve or sock and put it around the mason jar just like this. They're literally the easiest DIY I think I've ever made. They're so simple and to get the twinkling effect, you're just gonna take some of these wire lights, turn them on and stuff them inside of the mason jars and then simply place the mason jars wherever you'd like to add a little twinkling light effect. This next DIY has been done before, but it's one of my favorites. It's just a twine photo collage that you use by cutting three strings of twine and pinning them onto the wall and then taking clothespins and simply hanging each photo from the line. It's one of my favorites and the simplest things you can do. It's so cute and it's so easy and it completely changes the tone of your room. This last DIY is super easy as well. All you need are some sticks like these, some super shiny gold paint, and a vase of your choosing. You're going to spray paint the sticks and arrange them in the vase like so, and then just place the vase wherever you would like in your room. It has a laid back hipster vibe that I absolutely love. For some last little tips and tricks on how to cozy up your room, I definitely recommend blankets and throw pillows. They're the easiest, most effective way to warm up any room. You can find pillows at Target, at Walmart. I got mine from Home Goods, and they're so simple and they add so much to your bed. Adding a rug to any room will add warmth as well as dimension to your room and floor. Along with these things, I went ahead and purchased a few extra candles. I got this really nice wooden little plaque that I decided to put my little mason jar on. I am so happy with how this piece turned out. I think it looks so fun and exciting. I love the wood. I think it adds so much warmth to my bare white dresser. Um, and the perfume bottles added a lot as well. I went ahead and picked up a few little knickknacks to go along with the dresser. And I am so, so happy with the outcome. I think my room looks amazing. I hope these ideas and tricks were helpful for you guys. And I hope you enjoyed watching this. <laughs> 